Hey, 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 Virgo. This is your secret scribe here ready to do, okay, your, ready to do your Tuesday, October 29th to Wednesday, October 30th intuitive love tarot read. For all of those who are new to my channel, welcome. And for all who are returning, welcome back. I appreciate all your likes, shares, and subscriptions. Please don't forget to drop a like before you leave. Share and subscribe and comment. Okay, anything else? Wow. Okay, so Virgo, you have the Nine of Cups. This is a love reading. So uh, this is your energy surrounding love in the Ten of Wands. <clears throat> You want to drop a burden for some of you. This is a relationship because you want to be single and you want you want to fulfill yourself. You want to have your wishes fulfilled. And I feel that you know that whoever you're with is not fulfilling your those it is not your wish come true essentially, and it's been weighing on you very heavily. For others of you, some of you, some of you who are also in a relationship, there's a lot you want to get off your chest to your partner, and this is what I'm feeling that's weighing heavy on you. You may do this, be careful. <laughs> you may do this while you're drinking, okay? You guys may go out drinking and, you know, a little bit of liquid courage. You may just blurt out things in a way in which you wouldn't really if you had not been drinking. So I would advise you to be very careful of that, okay? But I do feel for the for the <clears throat> ones that want to drop somebody that they are already in a relationship with, I do feel that your intuition, um, that's what your intuition is telling you. And I believe you should follow it. Because you've been feeling stagnant for too long, they're saying. So let's see what's coming, what's walking into your life. And it's not because of a third party situation. It's not anything like that. It's just you're just unhappy. You also feel that the other person isn't happy, but it's like nobody's saying anything. Somebody has to make a move, right? Okay. Who's coming towards Virgo? Tell me. Who's coming towards Virgo? Who's walking into their life? Hmm. The Justice card. It could be a Libra that's walking into your life. But this is also a Twin Flame card of mine. Somebody who's very intuitive. This is somebody who's very intuitive, very balanced, very secure in who they are. Can sometimes have this stern look about them where it, it's like they may look unhappy on the outside, but it's it's not that. It's just who they are. They're not one to express extreme happiness or I'm just feeling they're not one to smile a lot. But they are good looking. They have this, it's gotta be a Libra because they just said they have this Venusian quality and Libra, uh, that's their ruling planet is Venus. Mm. How you respond is the lovers. You're very attracted to them. So I, this is the Gemini card. So I do believe you engage with them. At least for a one night stand. That's for sure. How do you meet this person? Mm. The four of cups. What is this short period of time? They're saying four days. 
it's they're saying for those of you who want to drop this burden okay and you're already in a relationship they're saying for some of you it's four days afterwards that you will meet this person really okay for others of you it is a fishing wharf I think that's they just said fishing wharf I think it's like um, they're showing me Cape Cod I live in Rhode Island so they're showing me like the fishing place in uh, Cape Cod Un momente. so some of you may be meeting sort of in a beachy area like that but near a fishing wharf Okay, so tell me, tell me more about this person. What else can you tell me about this person? Is this person trustworthy? It's a question I would want to know. The Page of Swords. Okay, they're encouraging you to sort of spy on this person, to delve deeper into who they are. And they're not, they're saying it's not because... Uh, anything suspicious but they said that this will ease your thoughts about this person like because you're they're saying your intuition will tell you that it, you know they're solid they're okay but you still have something in the back of your mind that is untrusting it could be due to this relationship over here for all of you it will be different or just with your experiences with people in general so they are urging you to sort of check out the social media etc etc but you will also for some of you will be communicating with this individual there will be a lot of communication that goes back and forth so they're pointing out the swords here as like in a, an abundance of swords so for your future with this person you have the ace of wands yeah there is a lot of sexual attraction the aces are all about new beginnings and wands are all about fiery passion love so there will be a new beginning in love with this person pretty quick after um, this um, other individual that you end things with for those of you who are single it's sort of the same circumstance but <clears throat> it's not four days they're saying in about four weeks if you're single if you're single it will be in about four weeks now my crown shock is tingling this has been coming up a lot like a lot of people the, the, some of the readings I'm doing people are meeting um, new people coming into their lives pretty quickly after they end a relationship okay anything else you can tell me about their future this person is very romantic this is the Knight of Cups you'll enjoy nights with them like nighttime dates they're showing me candle lights like the softness in the atmosphere so they're saying again looks are deceiving this person is good looking but they're they're reminding you of their um the facial uh, expressions okay you're you're it's going to be hard for you to determine in the beginning what they're feeling because they don't display it on their face and it's not something that you've come across before with anybody that you've been close to so they they said you you really have to get to know this individual to be able to know this and you'll know this in the future through body language and speech okay Virgo I hope you uh, resonated with this message it won't resonate for everybody but for some it will 
Please drop a like below, share, and subscribe if you already haven't. Comment and let me know if this is your story. I want to interact with you guys and hear from you. You have yourself a wonderful day, Virgo, and I will talk to you tomorrow.